In this video, we we'll see how to apply slopes to floor slab by using the shape editing tools. We we'll see how to add split lines and points to the floor to help modify the shape. And we we'll see also how to assign the variable thickness to the layer within the floor assembly and how that affects the shape editing floor. I have this model open and I want to change this uh, site road and we want to add a slope for this ramp in here. How to do that? By selecting the floor, I have the shape editing in here. And if we want to explore that, we can add a point to see how to behave. Click on add point and come in here and place this point, click on modify. Now you see that if I select again and click on modify and click on this point that I just added in here and click on this shape handle, this one, and you see that we have in here the slope changed. And if we want to get back, we just click on reset the shape and it's get back. Let's uh, uh, add this ramp in here. And the better way to do it is to go to the site plan in here. And in the site plan, I will have this, like in here, you see that this walls will, will help me uh, to modify the shape and design a better uh, site road. Let's select this one and get back to the modify floor tools here, shape editing, and click on adding split line. Okay. I can add split line from this side of the floor to this side of this edge. And coming back in here and adding from this side to this side. Okay. Now, if I get back to my 3D and zoom in, I see that this added uh, this split lines, but I can click on modify and select again my floor and get back to modify and select this edge in here. And you see this small arrow, I can change the shape or I can click on this temporary dimension and add the elevation of this floor, but I will do another way, select that. And until you get the snap to this floor and you see I have now minus eight feet and we can also add minus eight feet to that minus eight feet enter and I have nice ramp in here and we can click on modify and we have now our site site road nice and clean. Now we will have another exercise to add a ramp to have more accessibility beside the stair to this area. How to do that? I go in site plan again and I can go to a floor in here and I have my draw panel and I click on pick line and I have my floor generic in here. I can choose if I want this site paving and pick line this one, this one, and this one, and this one, we go to adjust here to have enclosed loop, nice and clean, and click on OK. You want to attach the, 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 the floor to the wall now, don't want to attach. And now if I go to the 3D, I see this ramp, I need now to add the slope. We did the same thing as the uh, 
site road but this one if you see it's assigned to the site level we want to assign it to the straight level and you see it's come to the straight level if i click on modify you see that now i can select that and go into modify in here and select here and just go until here and now you see i have nice slope but we need to fill this void in here by adding a variable layer how to do that select the site paving and click on edit and click on preview to have nice preview edit and now go into layers add another layer structure layer uh, get down in here and you can add a material to that let's have this concrete okay add thickness one foot okay okay now if we see here we have this shape in here and you see that it's consistent the layer that we add we can get to edit and structure and make it variable that's important okay we make it variable and if we click on ok and ok to apply the change and you see now we have a nice ramp in here added and we have the access to this area that's complete our exercise